kia ora tātou katoa, nā mahi nene ui ki a kaitou, ko wai au, ko nungataha tonga riro kake puku nā maunga, ko Rotorua nui a kahu mata momoe, me taupo nui a tea, nā roto, ko wai pa te awa, ko nā te whakaue, nā te turumākina, nā te inu, nā te kahu, nā hapu, ko nā te whakaue, nā te tūwharetō, nā te maniapoto, nā iwi, ko te aroa, ko tainui nā waka. Ko au te uri o ko tānira kengi, rawa ko Hingwaka Morrison, ko o ku matua, ko Nan Morrison Rowe, rawa ko Don John Tonga Nicholas, ko Henrietta Nicholas tōku ingoa. Kia ora tātou. Kia ora everyone, my name is Henrietta Nicholas. I was born and brought up in Rotorua. I went to St Mary's Primary School, Mokoya Intermediate and McKillop College. Uh, my career background is in Māori traditional and contemporary arts, being an artist designer practitioner for over 30 years. Uh, my last 10 years I've specialised in iwi integration into huge redevelopment, city redevelopment projects such as uh, railway stations and bridges. My last project, my last big project was working with the Southern Corridor project from Papakura right through to the Botanical Gardens in Manukau in Tamaki Makoto, Auckland. I was the Māori Design Specialist on the team and part of that role was to integrate, work with iwi and mana whenua, to integrate iwi narratives along that section of the highway into design narratives that could be utilised in concrete, uh, shared footway, footpath, uh, shared pathways and things like that. So as part of the Sir Howard Morrison Performing Arts Centre, I was brought on by uh, Rotorua Lakes Council and supported by Te, te Taumata o Ngāti Whakaue as the iwi artist. Uh, so I worked with Sian, the project team of council and the architects to develop and well, to identify iwi narratives within the location first and foremost, and then to design uh, some design narratives and formulate some thinking and principles around how to utilise them within the architecture of the redevelopment of the project. So that was called the Kaupapa Korero document, and it has a set of Māori order principles which underpin all of the design narratives, the Pakiwaitara, that are utilised within that whole framework of kōrero and visual dramatisation of the iwi narratives within the space. It was an amazing project to be part of because for me it's a heart project. Uh, it was really nice to do something for my hometown and for my iwi uh, and I liaised quite frequently with them on this and in fact when we worked through the final stages of developing the front entrance way with first light, uh, that was an amazing process of elimination. And by that I mean we had to sort of go back to our design principles, our Modi order design principles and the design narratives and really think about how people wanted to utilise the space but also play a really big part on the development of the iwi voice that came through. And what that meant was lifting of that space up uh, into the light and bringing some of that light to come through down into that space, into that front entrance way, so that you could not only see from the outside of the building right up into the first level, but the first level you could see right the way out into the front of the building. What's next um, in terms of the project for me is helping to develop the expressions of interest for iwi integrated artworks in terms of public artworks internal and external to the building and what this does is it really gives a support uh, a, a cultural visual uh, support to the narratives that are inside the building and around the different parts of the building um, we get iwi artists to come in and formulate what sort of art they'd like to prepare and be in public uh, space what I'm really looking forward to in terms of the project or the overall project is to be at that opening day when that first karanga call goes out and resonates through and 
throughout and within that whole entrance area out to the people and having the people come in and really be welcomed into the space and warm the space for everyone else that comes into the future of that of that space and that building and the performances that, that are going to be created within it. So, kia ora tato.